Hey everyone, what's up? So today, I have a new locomotive here. I'm going to be doing a review on this because I haven't been seeing a lot of reviews on this locomotive. But I have seen a few reviews on the Walters SD60, which is in the standard cap, but not the Walters Mainline SD60M. So, right here is my new Walters Mainline SD60M in the Conrail paint. Got this from Train World during their... 4th of July sale, so it looks really nice, so let's get on with the review. Alright, so being a Walters Mainline locomotive, it usually is, it is detailed, but it has some details that are not, that you can install, such as you can install the grab irons, stuff, so you can install ditch lights, and so it doesn't have any ditch, ditch lights, and the plow's nicely done. And it's got the metal KD couplers. I think it looks really nice. And if you look carefully on the windows, you can see parts of the windshield wipers. I think they're like molded on instead of like instead of like the ones that you have to install and stuff. You can see. It's got a nice four window cab and then uh the run up. The paint job is really nice. It's nice detailed. It says SD60 I'm underneath the road number. The roof detail is actually really nice. The radiator fan right here. It's really well done. It's got three chime horn. Which is, this appears like probably on almost on all the SD60Ms. So I think this is correct for Conrail since Conrail's most primary horn is the RS3L. The three other radiator fans back here look really nice. It's got some really nice details. Look at the brake wheel here. Looks awesome. Looks really good. nice. Everything looks really nice in this locomotive. Trucks look nicely done as well. Fuel tank is really also nicely done as well. It looks So, detail wise on the other side, it's got a nice bell, which is pretty nice. I actually love how they installed the bell on this locomotive because I've actually noticed, like, the scale trains operator, I noticed they did don't install the bell near the fuel tank, like I've seen on my CSX Tier 4 G bell. So, I might have to get a bell for that. For my hat. Everything looks really nicely done on this side. That side looks nicely done as well. Got more KD couplers. Handrail's nicely done. So yeah. And also, and on the cab window, you can also see the windshield wiper molded onto the window. If you can see. this side and they also it this locomotive does not come with sunshades so it's not a big no big deal and I think there are also windshield wipers on the other side as well I'm not sure you see hang on let me yeah I probably can't get that but on So, let's see how, how she runs. Oh, it runs really nice. It has lit up number boards when you run it. It's really nice. It has a pretty quiet motor, too. Pretty good, no. Pretty nice. Let's 
And yeah, it's a really nice locomotive. I really like getting the Conroe paint, and I plan, and I think it would make a great addition to my fleet of locomotives. So it's a really nice locomotive, and I really recommend getting these Walters Mainline locomotives. Because if you are trying to look for some cheaper locomotives, then the Walters Mainline usually has some pretty good discounts on their locomotives. So they're really budget friendly. So. If you're ever looking for like a six axle locomotive like this one, Walters Mainline is perfect for you. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll leave you guys with a run by. And thank you so much for watching. And I will see you next time. Bye.